Hello and welcome to my quick guide and overview for the Ixion Fate. This is a fate called A Horse Outside, located within the locks in Final Fantasy XIV Stormblood. Ixion seems to have a very long spawn timer of around 24 hours. Once spawned, it will be completely unattackable. You can try if you like, but you won't reduce its health at all. This is due to an energy shield around its body. To remove this, you will need to acquire an item called a Stygian Ash. This Ash, then, is obtained really by doing the new maps, these gigant skin maps. Very, very, very low drop rate. The item can sell incredibly well on the market board, but one will be needed to remove the shield on the boss by using it on Ixion's shield. Once the shield is removed, the boss has a few abilities which are detrimental to the fight. The boss will periodically spawn other horses that are unattackable you want to get out of the way from as they charge forwards. AoE Circles of Lightning will be under your feet to avoid, these do a lot of damage, and Aero Spark a much larger AoE circle to move from that will kill you if you get caught up in it. Later through the fight, the boss will spawn lightning elementals. These need to be killed before the boss's Thorian hammer move goes off. Failure to kill the ants will kill everyone nearby instantly and wipe the fate. Apart from this mechanic, the rest is just repetition of these AoEs. Once the boss dies, you should get two Ixion horns for gold, and reports of only one for bronze for certain, I'm not sure about silver. You will need a total of 12 of these horns to be able to obtain the reward from this fate, or if you're incredibly lucky, the reward can actually drop from the fate itself at a very low drop chance, probably 1 or 2%. We are, of course, talking about the Ixion mount, this model as an actual mount. These horns then are exchanged at the primal vendor in Ralga's Reach for the mount, which you have 12. Here's some footage of the mount, as ridden by a follow Linkshell member here, that managed to farm enough horns. Pretty jelly of this one, it's amazing looking. It's pretty fantastic, only kind of looks like a Shetland Pony version on his Lalafell. Um, this mount does indeed fly, much like Kirin, only just floats, no wings appear out of its body. It's a pretty awesome deal, and definitely something you want to farm if you're able. The servers have been rather unstable of late, and uh, earlier when I tried to do this and get some footage, um, we actually DC'd with the new logout measures, where we log out once a day, and I managed to log in just in time to get the rest of the fight, so there you go. I managed to get my first two horns of 12. Hopefully you've enjoyed this little video looking at the Ixion fight and the amazing reward. If you have any more information on this, please feel free to leave it below. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.